Hi guys, this is Danny with Danny Aquatics, coming to you from the fish room today. I just fed him about 15-20 minutes ago. I uh, had my uh, youngest son here with me, the one that was in the military, and uh, he was checking out some of the fish. He was really impressed with the arowana and the 550 that he couldn't leave. The way it looked, it was so huge. I said, well, it's not even huge yet. It's still a juvenile. But uh, they are amazing. These guys are something else. It's amazing. All the different colors and all the variations of different fish. It's God's creation. I think that's why I enjoy watching these fish. And uh, all of God's hand. But the 275 guys, they're doing great. Everybody, it's kind of a little cloudy. I just fed. And uh, I got some fish food that I'll probably never buy again. Uh, I mean, if you had smaller fish, it'd probably be all right. But it's the Omega One. I thought I was getting a good deal. I bought the five-pound bucket, and uh, let me let me pull it out of here. I got it down here in this cabinet. Let me check it out real quick. All right, guys, this is the five-pound bucket that I had purchased. I had got this off of. I picked this up off of Amazon, but. I should have read some of the comments. I mean, for some fish, it's okay. But this is what we get. Let me turn the light off here on this. This stuff is real powdery. Real crumbly. I mean, it turns to powder as soon as it goes in the water. And this is the Tetris of what mostly I've been using for two years. And this stuff really stays clean in the water. Fish love this. They really go for this stuff. And good thing I still have quite a bit of the uh, the larger containers. Well, not larger, but they're the 5.6. I've got about 20 of these put up still, but I have the the larger can, the one the it's like 1.75 pound cans. I've got a bunch of those put up, but I bought them when they were still pretty reasonable. They were only like 35 dollars. And I had purchased them from Chewy.com. There was a couple other places that I've ordered from. They were like $35, $36. You order over $50, it's free shipping. So I always order like four or five of them, of the big containers, just to have them to stock up. So, and the, this food does not, it, it has not broke down the, the Tetra. I've had some that, I mean, they, don't, they still have good uh, expiration dates, so it hasn't really expired, but... I'm sure, just like a lot of your canned food that we buy, has a long expiration period. So I always try to look at that. That makes a big difference. But I will not be purchasing this stuff ever again because, I mean, if you have like nano tanks, that probably would work. I mean, it smells good. It smells real fishy. So, but, I mean, as soon as it hits the water, it's just powder. And probably over half of it just goes down into the sump. So I won't be using that anymore. I mean, I want to use probably use it up just to get rid of it. And feed it to them here just every once in a while. But, alright, let me turn this light off. The 330 gallon tank, they're just doing swell, guys. And, uh, my Waru are doing great. I might be getting a, uh... Uh, a waru, a full-grown waru from uh, a friend on the internet, YouTube, and uh, he wants to rehome it because I guess he has already another male, and the the two males kind of fight a lot. So he has a uh, a pair already that he I guess he uses for uh, breeding and stuff. So I would I told him that I would rehome him, but I'm so busy. Today, this evening, and tomorrow is the only day, and tomorrow, most of the time, is my church day and spending time with the family, and then Monday, we have a two-week shutdown, so I'm going to be probably pretty tied up for a couple of weeks before I can get with him and uh, set up a date so we can, uh, if he, I told him that he could actually, if he finds somebody up there, to go ahead, uh, if not, but he wants somebody that has walrus already, so... I mean, I'll take it off his hands with no problem. But, all in all, everybody's doing swell, guys. I have one here in the uh, the little 10-gallon. 
kind of uh, medical tank that I have. I have two of them. They're kind of just uh, rehab tanks. If someone gets sick, I'll put them in here. But I have one of the Cinetrophius Lombardi. She is holding fry still. She should be popping them out pretty soon. Because I checked her and the fry are in her mouth. But one of them came out and she just sucked them back up. So it should be any day she should be releasing them. So, because she's still not eating, but she's kind of timid. She's hiding in the back corner. And everybody else is doing good. All the uh, albino uh, convicts are doing great. Those things are neat. And then the little baby are all doing great down here. They're growing. They're little haps. So, everybody's doing good. All the tanks look a little murky right now because I just fed everybody. And yes, I did. I gave them some of that powdered food, so now I kind of regret it, but oh well. Alrighty, let me see. Uh, that doesn't light up enough. I'll turn the light on in here, but it just goes too much, I think, sometimes. But they're doing good. These guys are doing swell. There's my Paco and all my other fish. My black belts, they're doing great. All my fire mouths, my viejas, a few silver dollars, my salvinis, those guys are gorgeous. And my Nicaraguan, those are all doing good as well, guys. All right, guys, just an update on the fish room and I really just wanted to do an update on the fish food because, I mean, if you're not looking, don't make a mistake like I did and get this stuff thinking I was getting a really good deal because, I mean, that was $90, $95 for five pounds. But I guess if you had, like I said, if you had small fish, that would probably be perfect. But a lot of these big fish that I have in here, I mean, they, they try to eat off of it, but it's just powder. It just go from one end to the other it just you know, they can't capture it it's too uh, too uh, too tiny the flakes but uh alrighty guys thanks for watching and I appreciate it guys joining me today and y'all have a blessed day and we'll see y'all in another video y'all have a good one take care alright